What's up guys, Michael here again. I've been talking a little bit about divergence and made some playlists on it, talked about it, talked about brainstorming, and I came across an example last night that was just too amazing not to share. So I watched on Netflix this uh, show Chef's Table uh, for the first time, and I watched season 2 episode 1, which dealt with uh, Alinea in Chicago with head chef Grant. And I gotta say, guys, it was probably the most incredible thing I've ever seen. I'm, I haven't gone to many fancy restaurants in my life, you know, maybe like once a year for something special. But this made me really want to go. Chef Grant exercised divergence and creativity in everything he's, he's done in his life. He does something where he does things normal restaurants wouldn't do. You know, at a normal restaurant, you sit down, you have a plate, you have a fork, you have a knife, and you got it. But Chef Grant takes an eight-course meal. And he has each course build off the next. And, and, and it blows people's minds on how the next food, the next meal, the next, the next course comes out of the past. And people's minds are blown. That's, the, that's one of his main goals is for these, his guests to have that aha moment, which is something that's really cool. He utilizes aromas after when people are eating it off a pillow. And every time you take a bite, it, it, it bursts out an aroma because he recognizes the scent is one of the most powerful senses in our body. And it can take us back to past and good times. Chef Grant is extremely resilient. He's been through a lot of a lot of tough times in his life as a young chef and, and health wise, and he's never given up. And he exercises a really cool way of brainstorming. It shows him with other chefs. They're they're writing ideas on the whiteboard, bouncing it back and forth. And he's constantly changing. No matter if he has a successful course or not, or people really like it, he's constantly changing at every every couple weeks or months uh, to think of something new to kind of wow the guests in a way. And I think that's pretty uncommon. So he's singing extremely divergently, extremely creatively. And that's why Lenny is like one of the most successful restaurants in the world. <laughs> he made me even want to just spend all the money I have and go. It's, it's, it's truly inspiring. Guys, I say check out Chef's Table on Netflix. Very cool series. I'm definitely going to watch some more. But Alenia, Google it. Check it out. You won't be disappointed. So hopefully you enjoyed.